Hi folks, it's Kieran here. Today's video is another little flat ground challenge. Um, as you know, I like doing these little challenges as a way to sort of build my consistency with particular flat ground tricks. This one has been stolen from the Santa Cruz uh, Skateboards YouTube channel. They do um, a series of videos called Product Challenges with Andrew Cannon, who is their brand manager and I think was a pro skater for them. Um, and what he does in those videos is basically they take out um, a board of some description um, and they'll try and do particular tricks on it or whatever um, and they give themselves 10 minutes to do these tricks and one of the challenges they do is a flat ground challenge called the grail of and what the grail of is you have to do all of a trick or a trick in all of the different stances so you have to do it regular switch nollie and fakie um, and you have to do them all in a row and you have to try and do it within 10 minutes it's a really cool fun challenge it's always really super super fun to watch uh, Andrew Cannon try and do these. He's a super super talented skater. He usually knocks them out pretty simply And I figured I'd give one a try myself I've only got one trick that I can do this with and that is the front side shove it So we're gonna try and do a grail of front side shove it. So 10 minutes to try and do all four front shoves um, In a row Quick disclaimer, I'm gonna do a nolly backside shove it because that's the same rotation as a front side shove it And that's how they normally do it in the video is that all the any of the shove it or spin tricks will have to rotate the same way so even though technically it's three front side shoves and a back side shove, naming wise, the board will rotate the same way each time. So um, yeah, I figured that that's the best way to do it because that looks a little smoother rather than having three of them rotating behind you and then the odd one rotating the other way. So yeah, uh, that's the plan. I've got 10 minutes on the clock or we'll put 10 minutes on the clock. Here we go. So yeah, let's... Uh, Let's crack on, try and get all the front shoves in a row in 10 minutes.
This is not great. I've got a real funk about the regular one. So uh, I'm going to skip ahead. I'm going to do the fakie one first. Try and go fakie, nollie, switch, and then come back to the regular one. Every time. This is so frustrating. I was doing so well at the start. Okay, folks with two seconds left on the clock we managed to get the grail of front side shove it the switch one was awful and i'm pretty sure i mainly caught it with toe on the ground i'll have to check it on the camera back but in the moment i didn't care um, all of them were like proper sliding around on the ground so i need to work on popping them um, i used to pop all of my shove it tricks but recently i think i've just got a little lazy with them and uh, I'm sliding them around a little bit more, particularly that Nolly one. That Nolly one I had on lock a little while ago, and now it's, you could see I was having some trouble with it and getting my feet tangled up and sort of kicking it over. So need to work on that one. But yeah, that was fun. A little frustrating in the middle there, especially when you're like missing the ones that you've got pretty consistently. Um, but yeah, I'll definitely be doing it again in the future. It's a cool way of sort of warming up. I'm definitely sweating now. So yeah, um, obviously, with the grail one it's the idea is doing four tricks 
it or the same trick in four different stances but you know this would be a really cool one just to do four tricks that you can do um, and that you're like reasonably consistent with so that you can work on building up to that really really solid consistency so you know have a think about it give it a go um, like a cool one would be like um, the 180s regular like front and back 180 regular and then fakie for both the half cabs i guess would be a cool way of doing it um you could do it with like the flip tricks like kick flip fakie flip regular heel fakie heel just to build up that sort of thing you know you didn't have to do it with all the stances i'll probably do a few more of those ones in the future with some tricks that are um semi-consistent i want to build some consistency with because yeah it's a uh, it's cool it's definitely fun and it, you've real sense of achievement doing it so yeah hope you guys enjoyed that little video um don't forget to like subscribe if you're new comment all that sort of jazz as always folks huge 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 thank you for watching and i'll see you guys on the next video take care